Gu I was expecting uh, a whole gummy. Oh. <laughs> um. It was not good. My name is Sid, and on this show we're going to be trying new foods and new products to see if they're worth the hype, pretty much. Every episode I'm going to be on here with a new person to try new food or products. Today we're going to be doing food, though. Today our guest host is... This is Dylan. He's our guest host today. He's going to be trying the weird product with me. Um, oh, well. He's substantially taller than me in this chair, but not in real life uh, at all. So tell me some things about yourself. How old are you? What do you like to do? I, um, I'm 15. Um, that's it. Okay, so Dylan is 15 years old, which is a year younger than me. Therefore, I'm superior to him. That's not true. Uh, hey guys, I'm just going to take a moment to talk about one of our sponsors for this video. Harmon Honey is local to Lebanon. They're a small business that sells um, honey to anyone who wants them. It's actually owned by my grandparents. They house their own bees and harvest their own honey. The bees are actually right in their backyard. The honey has no added chemicals or preservatives. It's all natural. I'll be putting a link in the description for anyone who may be interested in all natural local honey. Our product. It's usually known for trying to help a bowel movement. Um, and old people eat it. Like me. Like, yeah. yeah. So this is our product today that we're going to try. Figs. We're figs. trying dried figs today. Um, so, figs. Figs. Uh, I, I know what figs are, but I've never, I don't know what figs are. Me, me either. Okay. okay. So, there, I'll read the back of this. A nutritious and delicious fruit. Mission figs have a sweet, honeyed, is that a word? Honeyed? Honey, I guess. Honeyed flavor with a hint of berry. Deep purple, ripe, and tender. That sounds oh. like something to describe a meat, not a berry. Anyways. It'd be a bad not cooked meat. It says they're perfect for a snack. In big treats or as healthy option in a salad um, or granola mix. Delicious paired with cheese or chocolates. Mm. Hey, Dylan, you want to go eat some cheese and figs? <laughs> yeah. Oh, my God. So, it's about 100 calories for four figs. And um, it's packed with carbs. There's a lot of carbs. For no reason. There's one grain of protein. So that's pretty much all industry from facts we have for that. So, um, I got some paper towels because I need to show you guys this thing. Okay. Yeah. Dylan, you can have the ripped one. Alright. So, nice. I also have water. I don't know if Dylan has water in case this is disgusting. Alright. Um, it's okay. So I guess he doesn't have water. But we have trash cans in case it's that disgusting. Um, trash cans. Whoa! Okay, so let's, uh, let's take a look at it before we try it. Ugh. Oh, God. Oh, it's mushy. Oh, my God, that looks horrible. <laughs> it's a little oh, sticky. Oh, that's so gross. Oh, gosh, <laughs> um, ew. So here's what it looks like. Um. Really? Um, it looks oh, like God. something, but I can't say that because <laughs> this is a PG show. I don't even want to touch it anymore. Um... <laughs> It definitely does not look appetizing. It it looks pretty much like it does on the package. It, it, not really, no. I mean, it other looks than horrendous. the color. Other I mean, than the color, I mean, it looks yeah. okay. Uh, how do you think this is going to taste? Though? Horrible. Oh my god, it's going to be horrible. Um, I agree. And we, uh, I forgot knives, so you just have to bite into oh, it. Gosh. I really, there's no telling what the inside looks like. Um, Probably there's no like example of what. Yes, it there does. Is no, that's the actual ripe fruit, not the shriveled. That's a good point. Um, so there's no depiction yeah, of the no. inside of these berries. Probably gonna look the same as the outside. Let's smell it. Okay. It smells like, cr it smells like raisins, but like, this is like a raisin, but it's way bigger and it's like sticky. It does smell like a raisin, but... But it's like yeah. po more potent. So yeah, you want yeah. sure you I don't sure. even know if we're supposed to eat the whole thing. Or yeah, I don't know. I'm not. There's I'm no not. Dis there's no uh, uh, instructions on I'm just going to take a bite of it like this. Oh, no. Do you want to go first? We should do it at the same time. We should do so, it at the same, same time. time. Okay. Who wants to count down? Davin, you want to count down? Okay. okay. Three, two, <laughs> one. <laughs> oh, 
<laughs> they're like brown on the inside. <laughs> Let me taste it. No. No. <laughs> I'm not uh, doing that. No. It tastes like animal feces. <laughs> the color. You want to try one? Oh, so Dalvin wants to try one. Oh so, um, it's brown on the inside. Yeah, it's that bad. There's no <laughs> it way. is that bad. There's no way. Dalvin likes okay. it. Okay, all right. Well, at least that's one out of it. Oh my gosh. Look inside. Oh, it looks like bug offspring. Uh, that's horrible. That is really oh my bad. Gosh. This oh. is horrendous. I thought it was going to be better. I, didn't I think thought it was, was going to be, be good, like. But. Are you going to eat your whole thing? Look inside of it, Davin. Yeah. Oh gosh. How? Um, How so do you what do that? You, what do you rate this one out of 10? Zero. I rate it. Um, a zero, because it's not even edible. Like, yeah, I mean, Davin's yeah. eating it, so I mean, that, that's a one, actually. I still don't give it a one. <laughs> actually, it's leaving like residue. I'd, I'd okay. give it a one this, and a half. This, I'll give it a one just because I kind of can get used to the smell. Yeah, the smell's not, not bad. And the fact that it's like, Davin's eating it, so that means other people around the world will eat it as well. Yeah, like our grandparents. Um, yeah. yeah. It says there's tr nutritional value, but there's only four grams of fiber and there's a lot of carbs and things like that yeah no, and these are supposed uh, to help you like with fiber but there's only four grams so mm -hmm. i rate this a one out of ten let's just look inside this it looks like oh, bug oh, yeah. eggs no it, it does davin do you want to show the people on the camera it looks like bug eggs inside yeah, don't know if y'all could even see that. Even but I can agree that looks gross. Yeah, it's yeah. disgusting on the inside. So we're gonna toss this. We're gonna right. toss this. Um, uh, what's your opinion? What's your full-on opinion about these fakes? Okay, well, um, as you thought, as you saw, I threw it up. <laughs> yeah. But other than the taste and how it looks <laughs> and everything about it, <laughs> the smell is okay. <laughs> the inside of it, it does look pretty bad, but I do understand how some people could like it. Um, like Davin liked it. Yeah, no, it's all a uh, acquired taste. Yeah, subjective. Yeah. yeah. My rating is like a one personal rating. I hated this. I would never eat this, and I would never even try this in the first place if it wasn't for the show. Got to do it for the show. There's like added potassium, which is kind of suspicious. Um, it's the smell. Yeah, the smell's not that bad. It was bad at first, but you get used to yeah. it. Yeah. Um. And it's really disgusting looking, and it feels disgusting. It honestly feels it, disgusting. It it's it like does. squishy ball. Hey guys, I just wanted to come back and talk about another sponsor we have for this video. Emmanuel Studios is a stained glass company that's actually also owned by my grandparents. Um, we restore and make windows for churches or just anyone who wants them. Stained glass windows don't have to be used for religious reasons. They can also be put into houses or other buildings. And you can actually make little statues out of them. I've worked there a few times and I clean the glass. Everyone there is very careful and everything there is homemade. I'll put the link in the description for their website if you know someone or you are someone who's interested in maybe purchasing some stained glass. I think that's it. I think that's all. So you would not recommend this or would oh, you recommend it? No, I would definitely not recommend it. I'd maybe recommend it to someone who is insane <laughs> no offense davin um <laughs> do you want these they're not that good okay so they're okay. not that they're not even that good to people who would eat i don't them. even know if my dog would eat these exactly so <laughs> i would not recommend this to people because davin ate the whole thing and he still wouldn't even eat another one probably and he wouldn't take yeah. it to his house yeah yeah um, one out of ten. One out of ten i hope you guys enjoyed our first video and usually I'm probably going to try to do more than one product per video. This episode I want to give a little bit more um, background information on what the show would be like. I hope you guys enjoyed and I hope you guys will come back for another video. Anything you want to say? Um, nope. Just like and subscribe and uh, we'll see you later. Bye. Bye.